Welcome to today's video, you guys. I love this look and I love love. <laughs> if you want to see how I got this super lovely look, then keep on watching. So guys, let's hop right on into today's Valentine's Day tutorial because we're just going to do it. So I'm going to start with my face as per usual. And I feel like I want today's look to look super dewy, almost sweaty, but not. And I actually want it to look wearable. For today's primer, we're going to be using the Touch and Soul Glassy Skin Balm. And then, like I said, I want to keep this look super dewy. So we're going to be going in with my favorite, Maybelline Fit Me Foundation. We're going to conceal all of my dark circles away with the CoverGirl True Blend Concealer. And I always do my concealer in this so that my face looks lifted. And some people make that really funny face when they do their, con their they do their mascara, but I don't want to do my my concealer. <laughs> Kinda add a little bit here, a little bit here, a little bit there. Now that that's good, we're gonna go in with the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder. We're gonna set it and forget it. And you already know we're gonna be going in with the Luxie Beauty Precision Foundation Brush. Pat, 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 pat. Just to make sure there's no creases. And then we're gonna pat it again. Same thing with the under eye. Make sure there's no creases. Pat, 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 pat. And then we're gonna go ahead and grab a fluffy powder brush from Ilux Cosmetics and that's set the rest of your face. So we are gonna be going in with some bronzer, blush, highlight, the whole thing. And we're gonna be going in with none other than my favorite, as y'all should probably already know. <laughs> The Ace Boutte Bronze in Paradise palette. I'll be doing this shade right over here with my very trusty complexion brush by Almar Cosmetics. Okay, no, we're not actually doing that. Gotta rub it. <laughs> Boom. Of course, down the whole entire nose. Well, on the left. <laughs> I can't even say that. What the heck? <laughs> and now that we're looking a little crazy, going with an empty, more angled, fluffy brush and just kind of blend everything together. Some blush. And we're gonna go in with my favorite. Which I never didn't think was gonna be my favorite when I got it because I was like, oh my god, it's a pink, but now I love it so much. Ciate London Marbled Light Blush in Dusk with my Luxie Blush Brush. And smile. And then just place it over here somewhere. Mm hmm. We're gonna use a lot of blush today because it's Valentine's Day, and when you're in love, you're just, you blush. Let's create that effect for all day wear, baby. Oh my god. And a little bit in the middle of my nose. Like a letter B. Like that, so it looks like I've been out in the sun or I'm just very blushy because my Valentine is telling me how pretty I am. Some really bad jokes, guys. I'm sorry. We're gonna put on some brows because I look a little naked. We're gonna go in with the Brow Bar True Glam Makeover Brow Kit. We're gonna mix between these two shades right here. The lighter color. Oof. 
start blending that ish up. I'm gonna add some brow gel, which if you don't know what it is, clearly you have not been watching me long enough and that's a problem. Sip tea. That's actually really coffee. I don't drink like that, I was just doing it because of the meat. Okay, so we've come to the part where we make this look more valentines -y and more lovey-dovey and flirty and pretty and cute and date nighty and more nice. <laughs> so for today's Valentine's Day look, we're gonna be going with this palette right over here, which is the 39L Hit the Lights palette. It's huge, like, just for your perspective, it's freaking huge. But I love you because there's so much that <clears throat> you could do. I'm gonna be using these three shades up here. We will hella be using our color switch today. And I'm obviously gonna hop into tweeze portion. I'm gonna use this in my crease as a transition color with a fluffy Sephora crease brush. Okay. Guys, I'm done my luck. I hope you enjoyed. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. I think I'm gonna do a little bit of a halo moment. So I'm gonna hop into this brown right over here. It's kind of like a reddish brown. I'm gonna go in with this M433 brush. Going to, okay, that's much more brown than I thought, but that's a-okay. And in the beginning, there's no going back. I have to do a halo eye now. Yep. Hey guys, this shade is so pigmented, holy crap. Take a pencil brush, blah, 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 pencil brush from Moda Cosmetics. So I'm just gonna go in with this pencil brush and slightly buff out the areas that we already have, but I'm not gonna move the shadow from the spot that it's in too much. I wanna keep everything in its place and not blow it out too much. And then I'm gonna go back in with that Morphe brush. And whatever is left on the brush, I'm just gonna kind of, I don't know, do this. <laughs> and slightly wing it out, I guess, yeah. Okay, so since this is looking a little more purple than red, I'm gonna go in and put a red right on top of this shade that I have now to bring all the red in it. Really hope this goes well because that's, that, that's red. I'm gonna go in with that first brush again. And I think I'm done with the dark part, honestly. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this brush with no excess product and I'm gonna blur the lines where the halo portion is gonna be by just going back and forth really lightly into the negative space area. I'm gonna add a little bit more of that red just on the outside with the pencil brush by just kind of tapping it in because it's looking a little purple. I thought I'm gonna do the same thing in the inner corner. It's red. Back in with the first brush. I know you guys probably. I stopped switching brushes. <laughs> but 
honestly. That's just how I do my makeup. Okay, cute, 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 cute. Okay. I'm getting hot with all this blending. So I had the idea of going in with this Ape Beauté Scarlet Dusk Palette. I'm going with this shade Aurora as my halo color. But again, that looks quite purple. I don't know if it's gonna pick up the purple in the rest of the look. I mean, I'm all for purple, but I'm trying to make this like a red pink vibe. I think I'm gonna do, I think I'm gonna do something crazy. I'm gonna take that pencil brush. I'm gonna go into the red shade. I think I possibly might be making this a reverse halo. I don't even know, but I'm gonna put the red shade underneath. In that halo spot. Okay, that kind of looks cute. And then, whoa, that's so bright. Put that shade over top so it has a red base. You know what I mean? Jelly bean. <laughs> There's gonna be so many bad jokes in this video, God. Oh. Now, I'm gonna go in with that Aurora shade from Scarlet Dusk Palette, and I'm gonna use my finger. <laughs> Please clean right. Oh my god, it's not even showing. What? What the heck? Oh my goodness, only the red is showing through. Okay, okay, this is coming through more of like a hollow. Let's just keep packing it on a lot. All the way to the crease. Okay. Okay. We didn't mess up. We didn't mess up. Going back in with my pencil brush. Just in the crease with no product. And I'm feeling like this look needs something a little on the lower lash line. I'm going with a mix with that brownie and the red. I'm gonna combine those, so I'm gonna go in the pans and then I'm just gonna just do this thing. Okay, so with some very careful consideration, I decided to add eyeliner, but we're gonna add a powder liner. And we're gonna have some pink mascara for Valentine's Day. I'm gonna go in with some MAC lip liner in shade Kiss Me Quick and fill in Tarte's Tartiest Lip Paint in shade Extra because I'm extra. All right, we have a success. The lips are on. Time to add my second favorite thing highlighter Artist Couture Illuminati Loose Powder. Yes. Oh my god. And ladies and gents, we gotta finish it all off. We gotta lock it all into place with the Mario Badescu facial spray. That's almost the best feeling in the whole entire world. All right, you guys, that ties up today's tutorial. Thank you so much for hanging out with me, guys. It's always a good time, and I cannot wait to see you in the next video. Bye, guys.